Hello and welcome to the Pineapple Dance Vlog. My name is Ben. And my name is Carly. So Carly, um, I just did a really mean, intense workout the other day. Right, but who did a better press up? No one, I did. <laughs> So we had the pleasure of having Louise Hazel at Pineapple for a while and she was doing these free fitness classes for us. Yeah, so we jumped in and we got a great interview with her and we also took part in one of the classes. And I appeared to be better than you. No, 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 no. no. Ever so slightly. The, the video will show who's better and it's clearly me. Louise didn't know what she was <laughs> talking about when she said you had a better press up than me. Let's just watch the video. Here at Pineapple, we have been lucky enough to be joined by Louise Hazel and you have been doing free classes, so tell me a little bit about that. Uh, well, I decided that I needed a venue really centrally. Pineapple was my natural choice. Um, I've just launched Free Fitness on my website, www.podiumeffect.com, so check it out. And um, in celebration of that, the 60-day plan, I wanted to give members of the public the opportunity to come and experience it for themselves. And some brave people have turned up. Not many have survived, <laughs> but they've definitely turned up. So tell me about how you came about to do this. Like, it, obviously, you're an athlete. <laughs> So is it something that during your training you thought I'm going to try and one day give, give something back or what, what's the reasoning behind it? Well I think the one thing that really struck a chord was how throughout my athletics career I'd always been given a free training programme. My coaches turned up relentlessly, they you know, worked full time job, jobs as teachers and so I just felt like when I qualified as a personal trainer there was definitely something that I had to do in order to make sure that the average person on the street had some guidance. And so that's why I built the podium effect. I mean, I think it's brilliant. And I, I know that you mentioned you're going to go into universities or you're doing yes. something over there. So what, what's that about? Yeah, so really exciting. This year is the first year that we're doing a live tour. So had you heard of pineapple before? Because I know you did the jump with Louis. So I didn't know if that was your yeah. kind of way in. Or... I, mean, I watched, obviously, the pineapple uh, TV show. And so I was well aware with, of Louis before I ended up on a television show with him jumping off mountains. Um, but no, it was, uh, yeah, it was, for me it was the natural choice to come somewhere where fitness, dance and all those things are combined. And have you, have you taken a dance class before? I haven't. You haven't? No. Hello, you've been here the whole time. You I know, I've been here for me. five weeks. Okay, but, you're um, going to have to come back and do a class. What would you recommend? Uh, I think maybe a beginner's street or beginner's hip hop. I think you might, but yeah. I mean, I've shaved the head now. Yeah, you, I'm ready. You look, I've got you the look edge. the part. You look, you look great. So I can twerk. Should... <laughs> I can twerk like the best of them. Yeah, well, we might have to watch that later. <laughs> um, just before you go, so as a female, I struggle with press ups. Mm -hmm. And is there an exercise or something that you could show me in order to say, you know, if you do that daily for a week or a month, I might be able to actually get down and do a press up? I think a lot of women struggle with press ups. Yeah. It's, you know, upper body strength is not something that comes naturally. It's something that even athletes develop over years and years. And so it's just about simple progressions. All I can recommend is starting on your knees, but okay. get it right from the beginning. Right. Um, I think a lot of people tend to stick their backsides out and take the pressure off of the forearms, get right over on top so you're almost in plank position. Okay. And drop those knees to the floor, but make sure that your back is really nice and straight so that right. your arms are taking the weight okay. and just you know build up if you can only do five do five if you can work up to ten and then by the time you hit ten when doing them correctly on your knees you'll be able to do one full one and right well i'll definitely be giving that a go and we're going to try your class now so Super. guys get along hashtag fit for free was yep. it in a minute yeah fit for podium free. effect and the podium effect Louise, thank you so much thanks for mm. having me You're not even halfway through, how's it going? Okay, it's good, it's great. Have press-ups are actually better than your... Oh! Yes! Oh. If you'd like to know more, you can check out our website. And make sure you follow us on social media. Give us a tweet.